Great Agamemnon leapt up, his face contorted with rage. He spoke thus to Calchas. So-called prophet, you have never been anything but trouble to me. You just love spewing out your poisonous prophecies. Not a single one of them has ever been any good. And now we hear that the anger of Apollo, all this plague and death, is all my fault. So I am to give up the dark-eyed Croesus, even though I prefer her to my wife at home. She is just as beautiful and clever, and has a more pleasing disposition. But I want my beloved army to live, so I will do as you ask. But give me another prize at once, for it is not right for me to have less than others. The godlike Achilles replied, Great Agamemnon, unequalled in many things, but especially in greed, where will a fresh prize come from? I see no great store of common property here on the beach. The plunder we took from the towns around has all been given out. Give the girl back now and we will compensate you fourfold when we seize the walled city of Troy rich in gold. Agamemnon, king of men, replied, Achilles, you are a great warrior, but you cannot outwit me. Do you want me to stand here and be robbed of my prize while your prize is safe? The army must choose a new girl for me, one to my liking, or I will take your girl or someone else's, and then what an angry man we will have. But now, put a black ship to sea, load the animals and put Croesus on board. Let Ajax or Odysseus be in charge, or you yourself, and let us offer sacrifice to win back the favour of Apollo.